So the show is starting to spice up a bit now. If you didn't watch last episode, I ended up having a tour of my side team's base where they allowed me into their secret bunker and showed me all of their private stuff. I was told that they are also working undercover as the FBI, which I then later returned to my CIA vault to find that they left a book for Ryan and asked for his cooperation in their task. So obviously I am undercover and cannot help, so I'll just leave that to Ryan. Then after that I went and updated their whole team on the information wall to ensure that our wall of information is up to scratch and up to date so that we know everything. And as usual, just before today's episode, I just want to say a huge thank you for all the support on the show right now. There is a giveaway going on on my Discord from the time of 7pm UK time for the next 24 hours on the 19th. I have a chance to join this show, so go over to my Discord, first link in the description, go and try, you never know you may get in. Anyway, without much Without further ado, let's get into today's video. So we are back at the island. I know a lot of people have said you need to stop being at your island because they're going to catch on that you're not actually living at their base, which is a very good point. Like, I do need to chill being here, but I just love this base too much. It's amazing. I've not even been adding anything to it. I just really like the design of it. Anyway, I need to go over there because, as you guys know, Last episode, I went to the CIA bunker, as I said earlier, and updated it, and everything got fixed. So now when Ryan gets on, he will be up to date of what my mission is going like. However, I completely forgot about mentioning the Vikings. So I'm going to go over there right now. I'm going to quickly farm some sugar cane, and then I'm going to get the maps done. Right, okay, I think I've done it. It's in a really awkward position, so I've had to do all four corners. Because it is right in the corner of four maps. Like, I'm in the bottom right of that one. The top left of that one. Then top right of this one. Like, it's just a complete mess. But I've got it sorted now, so I've got both of the maps done. So I'm going to head over to the bunker and get these things placed down. I've got some signs and I've got some item frames as well. So I should be able to update the bunker with sufficient evidence. I don't think the... The FBI have been back, but I've obviously not been to the bunker back yet. So, I'm going to head there now, and then I will meet you guys there. Okay, up to now, it doesn't look like the FBI have been in here. Nothing. Nope. Up to now, anyway. Unless they've put something down here. Nope. It's all, it's all the same. So, yeah. Last episode, after last episode, I did, in fact, add the maps for the two places that I didn't actually end up doing in the video. I completely forgot. But now I've got the map for the Vikings. I can add that up here. So, it is obviously a four-map four map sequence uh where's this okay i'm having trouble because i forgot which order it's all in so is this bottom left okay then this is top left okay yeah i've got it now i've got it boom there we go so that is the vikings base area damn that map is looking cool so obviously that's their main base they've got the little path there we still don't know whose base this is we've got ice deals huge base on here these maps are still updating unfortunately because i've got to be near them to update faster but because I'm really far away right now and underground, it definitely doesn't help. Okay, yeah, so there's Raven's base. There's been a load of changes there for this base. There's been... I don't know. I found a base. I'm probably going to show it next episode because it's crazy. It's worth a whole episode itself. But I don't know if it's that base, but revamped. Obviously, the Vikings. I steals base. I got the boat. I got the main bit. The runway is cut off. But obviously, they'll find that whenever they get there. And then Faction's Ducks base, which is like on the mountain top right here, obviously. It's really blended in. It's, he's done a cracking job at blending it in, but you can tell where it is. But yeah, Viking's base, I can actually add to this, saying it's a solo man, and it's X Evan plays. And while I was editing the video, I don't know if you're actually supposed to pronounce that seven plays. Would make sense, but it could be X Evan, because I don't know if his name's Evan. I don't know. That's a bit off topic. Anyway, so... Raven's base. Last episode, I said I was going to set up a bit of a campsite near his base so that I can launch an attack at any point in time. And I believe somebody has beat me to it. So if I head over towards Raven's base now, I think I know the direction from here. You guys, I will show you guys what has happened. Oh my god, I did not expect someone to do this before me because this was crazy. Now I have suspicions as to who it is, but I'm not going to say that until anything comes up like apart from that still got the fbi thing there yeah all right so what i'll do because i don't want to show where this bunker is i will come back to you guys when i'm at raven's base aha there it is right i found his base i knew it wasn't far i i've been told that some stuff has gone down so obviously there's been a nice addition there i see a bit of a clock not a clock tower a watchtower i see a bridge oh they've also decked out the cave a bit what's down here is there any of them online I don't know who's on their team. Okay. 
So an obsidian bunker door and the cave is cut off there. I really like this. Right, so that bunker door is new as far as I'm aware. I've never actually looked in that cave. Wait a second. Oh! Okay, so they've got a barrier. You can pull it down and push it up. Okay. And this is just a watchtower, I'm guessing. Or a guard tower, should I say. They can shoot people coming in. Okay, I like it. I like it. Obviously, they've still got the runway over there. The helicopter. Now, this is what I've been told. And it seems to be correct. Somebody has blown up their base and got revenge. All right, what does it say? Enjoy your holes. You've been warned. X minus 4 equals 6. X equals 10, of course. Go around to see the answer. 10. Good job. Yeah, I was right. Okay, is that, I thought that was a riddle. Maybe not. Right, so I don't know if Raven's obviously seen this. I think he's away at the moment. What's this? Is this their base? It is, because there's me. So yeah, this is the surrounding area. I don't see anything suspicious. Is that Duck's base over there? I think it is. I think our bunker's somewhere over there. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's over there. I know it's in one of the corners. But yeah, somebody has definitely launched an attack on them here. All of this has exploded down here. What's in the chest? What's the chest say? Oil refinery mats. Okay, I thought that was going to be a clue. The vault door? Still nothing going on in here. And another obsidian door. So, obviously they're hiding something. I don't know what it is, but they are definitely hiding something. But, I, I really don't know who did this. Obviously, I've got clues as to who it was. I see a big tower over there. What's that? Not a tower, but a tunnel. I'm going to go check out that tunnel right now, but I have no clue who has done that. So obviously I'm going to have to, I'm, I'm definitely going to be meeting up with Ryan when he gets back anyway, because currently he's taking a few days away. But when he gets back, I'm going to be meeting with him because obviously I've got a bunch of juicy information to tell him. So yeah, expect a video with Ryan as soon as he's back. So what is this? Just a tunnel? Something suspicious going on about that. Exactly lined up with that base. Maybe this is with them? Did they make it, maybe? I don't know. This has definitely, though, been mined out, aimed right at their base. So, I don't know what's going on there. But, yeah, I want to set up a little secret vault area around here. So, I'm quickly going to walk around because, at the moment, as it seems, online, there are none of them. But, I don't fully know their team. I don't understand completely who's in their team. I think, I know it's him and Saloj. But, obviously, Raven... Ryan's only put on the sign that there's two members. Surely a team this powerful doesn't only have two members. I'm trying to find the prime location for a good vault. Okay, somebody else has already tried to make a vault. Hello, whoever's base this is, we are freedom. We bring freedom to the world. Whoever mess with us, consequences will follow. Instagram and chats. Okay, so that is another team. Let me write that down on my notepad real quick. Okay, so that is another team. Where does this go to? Okay, let me just close this behind me. Because if somebody else comes down, I'm probably going to hear them then. Wait. See, I don't know if this belongs to Raven. Let me just pull out my going case. Is there going to be like sentries and stuff? Where are we going? Is this it? So it's not finished, wherever it is, or whatever it is, it isn't finished. Alright, okay, well, this is another location for another vault, which has been founded by the uh, Freedom team. I might as well close that up. So I wonder if that is Raven or Ryan's. Could be Ryan's watch out point. What's this cave here? Right, I think this cave is going to be my vantage point. I think I'm going to... Oh, this is perfect. Obviously, their base is right there. As far as I'm aware, nobody else has set up anything here. This is where I'm going to be starting to build my little vault area. So I'm just going to put a, that there. How do I make one of these power... Uh, the passcode doors? I don't want to do it, obviously, right now. I'll have to do that back at either Duck's base or my base. But yeah, this is where I'm going to set up my little area for my revenge against Raven. I definitely want to get it at some point. Someone's clearly beat me to it. And if he thinks, because he has every single reason right now to think that was me, I could very easily get the blame for that and end up being attacked again, even though it's not me. So if he finds this vault as well, I am in deep, deep trouble. I'm going to cover it up with silicone ore. So I'm going to dig this area out right here. But obviously I've got nothing on me right now to start this vault. So as, not, as long as I know that I've got this area set up to move into whenever I need to, 
I'm happy. Yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it like this for now. Obviously, I know where it is. I can come back maybe next episode and start setting up. Or I might do a little bit off camera and then cut back to you guys for next episode. But yeah, this seems to be a really good vantage point. And especially because it's got water around it, it can't really be blown up as easily. But yeah, that is their base there. As I said, I don't think there's anybody online. I did just walk all the way around their base and I didn't really get spotted. But, you know, you never know nowadays. I really want to know who did that. Like, obviously, I have my suspicions. I believe that it could be Freedom. And that is who I actually thought it was anyway. But... I didn't know who was on Freedom, because I know that Freedom were trying to get justice for everybody, and if they found out that I did that, or they, they did that to me, obviously they're probably thinking, yeah, he needs some sort of justice. So that could have easily been Freedom. Now, none of Freedom are currently online, as far as I'm aware, but, you know, as long as, if it was them and they have got me a little bit of justice, I am very happy for that. But, I would obviously rather do it myself, considering they did it to me, and I want my payback. So, I, I don't know, I may have to go and speak to Freedom if they come online later. But yeah, for now, I think I'm just going to leave that. So, I'm, I think that's going to come to the end of this episode. Now, tomorrow's episode, I have a lot to do. So, if you guys do want to come back for next episode, be sure to subscribe with notifications on so you can be one of the first notified. I, unbelievable. I now have notifications on for when someone comments on my, uh, my video on my phone. And in the first minute of my video, I had 35 notifications. Of comments so if you guys want to be first you guys got to turn notifications on because a lot of people are trying to do it as well but anyway I hope you did enjoy this video if you did be sure to go down there and smash the like button subscribe if you are new and I'll see all of you guys in the next video peace I can feel your heart